Hey y'all, it's Frankie. So in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to make a scrunchie. So, scrunchies are really, really easy to make and they honestly don't take that long. So you can make like a bunch at once if you wanna sell them at school or give them to your friends and yeah. I sold mine at school for a little while and they, I honestly made like a bunch of money. So it's pretty good. So let's get on to the video. So the materials you're going to be needing are a 4 by 20 inch piece of material, some pins to pin your fabric, a thread of your choice that should match the material, and some hair ties. You'll also be needing a sewing machine to sew your scrunchie. Okay, so the first step is to get your material. Mine is just some purple with this really cute pattern on it. And you're going to want to hem the material. So you fold the backside down one so it's a clean edge. I forgot to mention you'll also be needing some scissors to like cut the thread. And then you want to do the same thing on the other side. Okay, so now that we're all hemmed, you're going to want to take your hair tie and get the side of the material that you want to be shown in the scrunchie and fold it inside and around the hair tie like that so i'll do it again so you take your material fold it and then put the hair tie in just like that take your pins and pin the scrunchie all the way around so this is going to be a little difficult but you're just going to want to stick the pin in like so and stick it out just so everything is secured. You may have to pull the material through the scrunchie a little bit to get the sides even with each other. Let's talk a little bit about how I got into making scrunchies. So my friend taught me how to make my first scrunchie and I was like, oh my gosh, this is pretty cool. So ever since then, I've been on the scrunchie grind. And I've just made so many scrunchies, like hundreds, not hundreds, but like, you know what I mean? And I really liked making scrunchies because one, they're super cute and you get to like customize them by choosing the fabrics that you want. Scrunchies are a really easy way to make money. Um, I started selling them at school and I made close to like $200 off of it. So that is pretty great. Okay, so the next step in the process is kind of like the main part. So basically, you're gonna sew around the outside edge um, of your newly pinned scrunchie. Get like a centimeter away from the edge of the scrunchie when you're sewing. And it's okay if you just started sewing on the sewing machine, like scrunchies are super easy to make. They're a good thing to start out with if you're planning on like doing other things with sewing machines. And the closer you sew to the hair tie, the smaller your scrunchie is gonna turn out. So um, just keep that in mind if you like smaller type scrunchies or bigger. And you can also sew over the pins that you pinned in, but um, if they get, if it gets kind of like caught, just pull them out. Okay, so now that you're done sewing, just take all your pins out and um, put them in a safe place. You definitely don't want any of them falling on the floor or anything. This is what your scrunchie should look like. It does kind of look like a hot mess right now, but trust me, it will not once you turn it inside out. And that is leading into our next step. So our next step is to turn this scrunchie inside out. And you're like, whoa, how do I do that? Like, that's impossible. No, it's not. But you're going to want to take like one edge of your scrunchie and start folding it in itself. So it looks like this right now. And I take my finger and push it through um, the scrunchie and like pull back on the other material. 
And this is definitely the longest part of the process. This is gonna take you like, I mean, it really depends on your material, but for normal scrunchies, it takes me like two to three minutes. Honestly, not that long, but um, it's definitely longer than sewing it. Okay, so now that your scrunchie is turned inside out, it should look like this. It's finally looking like a scrunchie, but you have two unconnected ends. So you're gonna put one end inside of the other. I would put the um, bigger one into the smaller one. You're gonna sew right here so it connects everything. Okay, so now that your scrunchie is all sewn together, you are almost done. You just need to trim the little threads that have, have, have come out from your sewing. And with that, ladies and gents, you are finally done with your scrunchie. They're super fun and easy to make, and I definitely recommend them if you are looking for a way to make some cash if you're a teen. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Be sure to comment down below what you wanna see from me next, and subscribe to my channel if you like it, and turn on my post notifications if you wanna see my next videos, cause I think they're pretty cool. Hopefully you will too. And yeah, love you guys, bye. Super easy, easy. <clears throat> Throughout my days. Okay.